Chris? What did you do? Are you alive? Just leave me. Save yourselves. <laughs> do you need help? I need oxygen. You uh, skipped the pin and wiggle part, huh? I did the pin and wiggle. That's how we got this far. <laughs> it started down there and it ended right here. <laughs> uh oh. I'd run and catch it, but oh, I can't. Well, the view is a little different here. It's beautiful. And not only is the view beautiful, but so is this man here. We've got Chris. Chris is back, Chris. everyone's favorite man. Everybody's favorite, eh? <laughs> <laughs> so we're in uh, Steamboat, Colorado. We're going riding the Thunderstruck Adventures again. We're excited. It's been a long 14 hour trip. Got here last night, well rested ready to shred the pow. We actually are well rested, which is a miracle. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're gonna go down to their uh, their business front, get geared up, and uh, this, this my, is all he brought. I gotta get my mono suit. This is what he brought, Crocs. That's what he's riding in, <laughs> Crocs. First, we gotta try and get the uh, one ton dually out of this parking spot. Don't ask how we got in there. It was uh, sketchy last night. You driving? You're recording. Sure. <laughs> you got it in there. You can get it out. So do we yell after he hits the wall or before? After. You got to turn more. Okay. You know, that came out a lot easier than it went in. You did good. Okay, ready? We're going to lift it up and loosen the front strap. Yep. We did make it halfway out here and the tailgate dropped. And by some miracle, none of the stuff that we had in here deployed from the vehicle. Is it tight? Woo! You got a lot of tension. <laughs> Welcome, old girl. You're back to your stance. <laughs> All right. We got this this guy too here. This is Mini. Oh, Mini Chris. Little Chris? I don't care. We're gonna call him Mini. Do I have to start this before I go to the mountain? <laughs> you know, you guys like Chris so much, we ended up bringing two of them just for your viewing pleasure. Whoa! Get my tow heater on. <laughs> Crocs aren't doing their job. <laughs> We're at his uh, business front. We got our packs. We got a couple mono suits for these boys. Look at the rock. The old avalanche. There. Are you ready? Uh, we are ready. Are you ready? I'm ready. So we're all ready to roll now. Eventually. This is where he keeps all the gear. Then we're heading up to the mountain. And I heard he built a nice shed up yeah, there. Yeah, I heard. And that's cute. where the sleds are. That's where we're gonna offload. Let's saddle up. I'm not sure this does me good for my curves. <laughs> Why are your pants off? <laughs> Don't you worry about that. <laughs> uh, so here we are. That shed was not there. It was just a parking lot last time. Where do you suppose we park? Out of the way. Look at all the sleds lined up, boys. This 
is straight up madness. It is. I love it. It's like us got, going to the first cornfield. <laughs> this stuff flying around everywhere. So apparently today is the biggest day. They had the most bookings, so full house. Every sled's going, right, Clay? Yeah, so you guys got are you guys are on three Polaris and one skidoo. So Pull the short straw. Claim this one. Whew. Right into the fun stuff. Where's that lounge? Hey, you know me. Where's the lounge? You know me, baby. Baptism by fire. Yeah. <laughs> right into the most difficult stuff. As you can see here, we have a planted sled by Chris. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I was, I think, the first guy to get buried. You went all the way over, didn't you? Well, uh, I gassed it trying to side hill, and then I fell off, and the sled went uphill, and then... I blocked the trail for everyone else. I hope you got some good shots of me coming up that hill because the solid object in front of me. Take your tether off in your helmet. This is how the men do it. Oh boy. We'll see. As I say that. Oh boy. <laughs> oh! Well, now we're upside down. <laughs> Look hey, at you are on a log. I, I hit something hard. I know I did. That's why it stopped. It's 26. It's the new Polaris. <laughs> Rides great. Uh, this is why we upgrade sleds every year, guys. <laughs> One, two, three. Look at that. One owner never been on gravel. This is why you hire a guide service. Wife ridden. Wife ridden. <laughs> yeah, that one's going to be mine next year. It's lunchtime. I guess we're grilling. And we have fire. Ooh, that feels nice. How is it? Very good. Amazing. Wagyu burgers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nothing better. Look at, can we zoom in on his braces? Mm -hmm. It's a bite. Mm -hmm. It's in them. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, well, dinner time's almost over. It's really fun doing this. Mm -hmm. mm, they like to stand in the smoke. It follows us. <laughs> Actually, we're getting we're in a sauna. We're getting steamed. It sounds like your belt is really burning. Brody! <laughs> You know, you just got to believe that you have control, but I was ready to run. I, I don't believe in myself, so I'm glad you did. <laughs> Ooh, told you. If I had another saw, I'd cut that tree down. <laughs> no. This is deep. Fun. You can't even walk. Oh, oh. Oh, we lost him. <laughs> Why don't you just drive up here? I can't even get my body to help. I need your saw! <laughs> yeah. I would be very helpful. How's it going? We're, How's it going, boys? We're in a predicament. Brody, you're in the lumber! <laughs> we are in the lumber. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my. And none of us has our M18 Milwaukee saw. <laughs> we need one. I thought it was dangerous to be next to these trees. Like right. that you can they just can. shoot down yeah, like 10 feet. There's no snow under him. Right yeah, he's he's on, See, he's on he's on top of the tree, well, but he's still moving. Not in not in the tree. Well, I wasn't in, I was in the tree. Thought it would snap. <laughs> it didn't snap. Just openly <laughs> admits committing. It completely you stopped Your dead. Polaris is gonna snap before that tree. <laughs> It took two of us to break off what we did. Yeah, we did break off a little tree. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> nice catch. We talked about the no snow around the tree. We're, We're in deep. deep. Left leg yeah. down all the way. Jimmy down. This is when Doug was watching and saying, I'm so glad I didn't come with. I think if I had both legs together, I would have went straight down to my head. There's two trees. I didn't even know about that one. Yeah, I don't know if that's the issue right there. 
Well, it's next to my tunnel. And I wanted it out of here. <laughs> See? I, I think we should just roll it down. I would agree with that one, Chet. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Happy New Year, you filthy animal. Well, we're going to hit them trees, aren't we? Nah, I think you can just roll it this way. I would. Now. Yep. It's just a Polaris. He says. It's a loud Polaris. Not even a nice Polaris. Hey, you know why he says no, that? This. It's not one of his You're rentals. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, what? Can you kind of drag it backwards when it I'm, rolls? I'm going for the too soon on putting that saw away. <laughs> yeah. 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 No, 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 no. Other way, other way. Put, pull it the other way. Uh oh. Now you're... We might have to take these two trees down too. Gosh. Brody, bring her back you. here. I told you. Clay said it was going to work and it didn't work. It's because I wasn't directing the sled, that's why. Yeah. Hey, I got you. Yeah. And then you take the bus top off. Yep. Yep. You're stupid. Fall on your back. Yep. All right. What? What? I'm glad I could be the hold up for one time. I haven't there. needed the saw yet today. Timber. Hello. That's the first time I've broke that saw out all year. That's a fresh saw right there. Man. I Congratulations, so Brody! I'm so honored. Does that, yeah. mean, does that mean we're good or bad? <laughs> it depends on how you want to look at it. <laughs> I that was a lot of gravity. Mr. Frank. Oh, my <laughs> Mr. Frank. I don't want to beat him. Oh, no. Whoa. Oh! Uh oh. Be very, very careful. What happened? He threw it. Oh. He's making me work for it. He's a farmer. He ain't a. Athlete. Uh, it's been a long time since I've been an athlete. <laughs> <sighs> We're good, boys. Can't, I can't breathe. <laughs> How are you doing? Well, helping in theory, but mostly just the camera. You know. It's okay. Evidence is always helping. <laughs> if only the air wasn't so thin. How are you doing, BS? You know, this little break we had while you guys were messing around with them trees? Really rejuvenating? I'm ready to go. I'm pointed in that direction, which makes me nervous, <laughs> but I see you are too, so lead the way. Chris? What did you do? Are you alive? Just leave me. Save yourselves. <laughs> do you need help? need oxygen. You uh, skipped the pin and wiggle part, huh? I did the pin and wiggle. That's how we got this far. <laughs> it started down there and it ended right here. <laughs> <sighs> After I had just rolled my sled about eight times down that hill. I seen you were piled up at the bottom. I tried my, I, so I went up right where you had tried to go up and I tried my best to bow tie it because I'm like, that was vertical. <laughs> that was. I think I got it on camera, me going down. I'm like, ah, oh, it's a straight down. Yep. <laughs>
You almost had it. I bailed. You just got to You got to stay on the snowmobile. There. I don't know where everyone went, but I need a line. I'm not a Brody. All I've seen was a lot of s snow flying everywhere. I like this snow. It's like setting up, but yet you can carve, but you can pretty much climb anything you want to. As long as you know how to steer, and that's where the problem happens. You need help? Maybe. It's so fun riding with professionals. the position it just feels embarrassing I'm in a tree yeah <laughs> quite the place to park it was it had potential for success but <laughs> it ended in disaster Day two of riding. We're into day two of riding. We've hit the mountain. We are riding what is me and Brody's favorite part. Enough trees to make it difficult and that you can hit like a down here. And, deep and then deep enough to get stuck. Grade is a challenge. He's buried. Come on up, Eric! Eric! Bring it up, boy! Here he comes! Three down. <laughs> Or me. I don't like that he's higher. Oh! Oh! I should be fine. <laughs> you look like you buried it. It took me three attempts to get parked. So close you got to the tree two times. Twice I went down here, I couldn't hold it. Look at that shot. 
Woo! I hope I'm not. No, you I'm know, not. Clay did say to meet down there like 10 minutes ago, and here I was screwing off. Boys, I got so far up there. <laughs> I was up by some rocks. <laughs> there was a cliff. <laughs> I got up there so far, and I had to take a breather. Clay came and looked for me. He thought I had crashed. I Don't worry, I got it. <laughs> I didn't need your help. <laughs> This was something I didn't believe from snowmobiling in Minnesota that you just roll them downhill and hope they stop. Huh. But this is what you do. Flip them, roll them, tip them. How'd you get out? Ski pole. <laughs> Should be fine. You set yourself up perfect for a tree collision. Down, lots of breaks, and pray that you don't line up with a tree. Lean. It's intense. Lean. Lean. Where? Lean. <laughs> he is an impressive man. <laughs> I did. He did. No, I was still looking down on you. No way. Well, where were you? Buried, and you just drove by. I did. <laughs> I was coming down and I waved to you. <laughs> oh. oh, great. People up above us. This is a scary moment now. Oh, tree. It's a tree. Oh, this is when it goes really south. Don't you? <laughs> uh, that's my sled. Oh. <laughs> oh, here comes Clay. Man, this is this turned into a big party. I'm gonna get killed down here, I think. You're just a beast. I'm like 20 feet away from that snowmobile. Like straight in, and it's 20 feet above me. I did I did that three times. <laughs> and then What's that? I did that exact same thing three times. Yeah. Only I went all the way to the bottom. We were stuck up here. Pick a good line. I go that way. Oh. Them guys are insane. Oh, he fell off! <laughs> oh. Well, time to put the camera down and get myself out of here. We've gotten into a point of the end of, well, my skill level, and definitely some of the other guys. This is, uh, we, we came down that. And I think we can go downhill more. We might be in a zone a little over some of our pay grade here. <laughs> Are you, is you gonna walk down here? I'm gonna take Big your sling, we'll get him. This is the guide riding here. You don't look as cool on the flares. His, uh, his sled's up there. That's a skidoo hey! with a turbo. It's a 144. Things unbelievable. There you go. Walk her down. How is the big Swede and Chris gonna get down here? <laughs> Eric's gonna look at me like, what? Are you kidding me? <laughs> that is some grade. Good job! Woo! <laughs>
Oh, bye. Uh oh. I'd run and catch it, but oh, I can't. Ah. The tree <laughs> crunch. Just, can we replay the tree <laughs> crunch? Did you get that? <laughs> the big Swede met his ability. I feel so bad. <laughs> That, that might have been a $2,000 deductible right there. I think that oh, up. Yeah. I didn't have the camera going for this successful stuck. Oh. I gotta go see how bad Eric is. <laughs> I can't wait to go see this. We're gonna go look at the sweet. You planted her. That is a four inch tree. You were doing so good. This is some gnarly terrain. Wow. Who brought you down here? Well, you know, this was actually a spot that I was second in line and I was following and I'm like, I bet he's going down here just to have fun being a professional and I shouldn't be following. We're gonna make you all professionals after this trip. Then I look back and then everyone was following me and I'm like, uh oh, this ain't gonna end good. You gotta get and that's, now. that's where we're at right now. <laughs> I hope nothing's broken. <laughs> what? What are you laughing about, Clay? <laughs> The camera just don't do this justice. Hold it up, Eric. He's doing damage. Look at that. He must have had an angel from the Lord go shrine it down for him. <laughs> yeah. I don't need you. That was Clay's line. You got your tether. Okay, good. good. Sweet. Yeah. Little, uh, little plastic and that's it. What's the leaking fluids? That's his brake reservoir that he just lost brakes on. Or coolant. Is that... I don't know, that's a good question. Brake reservoir? <laughs> <laughs> or, um, sorry, shock shock. From the bottom view, it all went wrong when you let go of the snowmobile. You don't say. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna try to set it on that side there, okay guys? Unbelievable how easy he makes that look. That's what I was trying to do. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'll just superimpose you. Um, <laughs> yeah. Okay, you can have his sled. <laughs> the boobs. What is Chris gonna do? <laughs> oh, I don't know, man. There's a lot of concern. There's a buried sled there still. I forgot about that one. There goes all my confidence. Get me on the flat ground. <laughs> you just have leaking fluid, so. Hey, I'm gonna put that on the back of my tunnel. We're gonna bring it home for Christmas. Yeah. Next year. <laughs> no, we're gonna burn that. <laughs> Oh, uh, it's a broken plastic and here busted. Oh. Tile tape will fix it. I can't believe, I'm sure there, there's gotta be internal damages. You can't hit that hard and not wreck. Oh. The mechanic will be happy. Well, if you would have hit it here, I think he would have bent his arm. Come on, Chris. <laughs> He's earned that name. Look at that. It's going to wash on slow him. Slow and steady wins the race, baby. I'm so proud of him. He's holding elevation. He's going to just go all the way through, guys. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Battle boy! Yeah! Yeah! Woo! You, you put that sun in its place. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing, do, doing good, Chris! <laughs> Just Are you alive? <laughs> <laughs> Just a thumbs up. <laughs> you made it farther than Eric.
Are we okay? <laughs> Just another thumbs up. That a boy! <laughs> <laughs> looks so discouraged. He is, but he's doing, he's doing it. He's, he's freaking doing it. Got her. We got to turn around and we got to go back. <laughs> <laughs> I ripped my fenders right off my shoulders. I believe it. Judging by your pants. Right Are you? <laughs> it's not good. It's not good. What happened to your pants, buddy? Handlebars. Rip the suspenders right off my shoulders. <laughs> you ain't even a nasty terrain. I was going too fast. <laughs> oh. You done did it. I didn't realize it started sloping this much. I come flying up that hill and it was too late. <laughs> and then he laid there with the handlebar still stuck in his pants too. Yeah. This is this is day three. We did <laughs> we did manage to make it out of that valley that Clay had us in the ravine last night. We had supper. Now everyone on day three is really shot and it shows. Well, we can get down. We can go over that what do you think? I'm ready for the beach. <laughs> <laughs> that throttle before you started. I did that first day. First time I got Why? Stuck. Why is it pointed up so far? This has always been. He was kicking at it. <laughs> Which one got into you? Which should have your skin on it? This one right here. <laughs> this was pointed. There we go. That was down there like that. <laughs> Brody! Is that what ends the snowmobile trip, or is there going to be another wreck? You never know. We ain't to the trail quite yet. I think we're winding down. <sighs> They're not going to come along for our 14-hour drive? Well, maybe. Who knows what we get into. But i got to put this, you guys, back in there. I'll keep and I bought a different helmet when we were out here, because now I have no one of these things. So I can't even capture it. Crashes that occur. We've made it back down. Day one was working the cobwebs out. Day two was the funnest. Day three. Day two was the accident. My accident. Day three, the body just gave up for really pushing the limits. Three is enough. Yep. Yeah. But it was fun. Now we get to load this up. Can I just leave it here? Yeah, rent it out. That's a full house. I think he said what? He has like 80 sleds between trail and then like the back country riding. Look at this. This is not good. So now we're gonna get all full of mud. We're, we're in a water puddle trying to get loaded up here. Hello. I can't do much. Boys. Yep, here we go. That was a lot easier than lifting. Brody said we just can't have it here. Just can't have it. Nope. We're clean and hopefully uh, all of our nice gear in there don't get destroyed. You want to take your nice helmet out of there? I should. My brand new helmet that's now all sprayed full of foam. Nice. Maxed out the tire. And quit! <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
Good enough, right? We spot freed only a quarter of it. We got the windshield, so we should be okay. What happened? Same as cash. Swipe card to begin. And we maxed her out. We weren't the only guys. That's our guide from today. They're literally doing the exact same thing. No, this is not roadie clean. <laughs> Does it give you your money back? Or is it gonna eat the whole charge? It won't stop. Oh, of course, it's one of them. Push, press here to stop charging. It's a four dollar minimum. Nice. So we have to wash it for a minute. <laughs> Might as well go the heck with it. Why are the hazards on, Chris? <laughs> this whole group is a hazard. <laughs> <laughs> I had to have Was Chet it Brody clean? No, I had to have Chet take over because my wrist was really, really <laughs> hurting. <laughs> <laughs> the injuries. We broke him. Good thing he's almost done washing stuff. <laughs> well, it's time for the 14 hour journey home. But we've got one more thing we, we must complete before we leave. The FXRs are getting tired. <laughs> <laughs> so, overall, it was a great trip. I'd like to thank Thunderstruck for giving us the full pro ride guided tours. Definitely fun. I enjoy having a guide just because they keep you safe, get you unstuck teach you like we learned a lot stuck. what stuck we're never stuck no never stuck so if you guys have any interest i'll drop their website in the link in the description you can check them out it is a he's one of our buddies so that's why we always come back here and now we've got the 14 hour drive home you driving you feeling up to it i, I can i can oh oh I hate to be looking like a fool going down the road. You know, I thought we cleaned this. Yeah, I know. Horrible Brody clean job. All right, nothing's gonna blow out. Chris! Chris! <laughs> there they go. Chris! Yeah, they went. <laughs> oh, must, must be in high demand. About as rough as the guy back home. <laughs> Oh my. Well guys, we did make it home. We got home last night at 1.30, I think, in the morning. So that yeah, was a long, long day in the vehicle and we're all shot, but time to get back to work. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys in the next video.